I'm going to do a little experiment. I'm going to show you how quickly Jaxta Video Converter can convert the entire second season of Downton Abbey, which is about 10 hours of flash video file, to the iPad format. So I've got a stopwatch, all seven episodes of the second season of Downton Abbey, and I've got Jaxta Video Converter. This is the user interface. It's very simple. You put your files here, you set the destination folder where you want the files to go once they're converted, and you choose one of any of these really popular conversion formats, including iPod Classic, different Sony, Microsoft, different audio, and then Google TV or DivX formats. All I need to do is highlight the files I want to convert, drag them into Jaxto Video Converter. They appear. These little circles here indicate that all the files are ready. If I hover over the video player, I get a little eye. I click on that. It gives me video details and audio details about my file. It also tells me here how long my file is, and then it also tells me what the conversion speed is. So right here it indicates conversion speed is slowest because I've got it set to iPod Classic. If I go back to iPad, you'll see that all the conversion speeds have changed to fast. And what that means is that Jaxta Video Converter is actually analyzing the files that I need to convert and letting me know whether or not I need to convert both video and audio, which would be the slowest conversion process, or just video, just audio, or neither, to get my files to play on my chosen device. So for iPad, it's pretty fast, but how fast? I'm not sure. So that's why I'm going to turn on the timer and we'll figure this out. So I click Start and I'm going to click Convert. You can see now that this little circle has turned to a progress bar indicating my progress of the conversion. And then if I hover closer, I have the option to cancel. So I'm going to leave this alone and I'll be back shortly. So we're coming down to the wire. And as you can see, it's going to take it just a little over 15 minutes to convert over 10 hours of video. That is just phenomenally fast. So there we go. 15 minutes and about 38 seconds, and it converted all seven of my videos for me. If I want to play, I just double click on my converted file. It's bringing up my VLC player. There it is. And you can see how beautiful the quality is. I love the show. 15 minutes, 38 seconds, maybe 37, to convert just about 10 hours of video. Beautiful quality, so easy to use. It's a great tool to have on a Mac. So I hope you'll enjoy checking it out. Have fun.